to interaction with jet because jet because jet and medium constituent interact with each other so medium constituent can receive some energy and momentum from a jet and their the evolution can be modified by jet and it can contribute to jet observable in heavy ion collision and also some portion of jet energy and momentum are summarized during the propagation and and those guys can carry information of this, the sub process of medium summarization. And that can be very interesting. So we are interested in that too. And also it, uh, taking into account the medium response effect is essential for comprehensive understanding of jet quenching. And here, uh, so and I, I explained how we implemented medium response effect in jet, Jetscape. So for weekly couple discussion, we use recall. So uh, in Meta, LBT, and Martini. And for strongly coupled discussion, we use hydrodynamics. Uh, and, and, and to connect between them, we, 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 we inserted an intermediate stage that is simulated by causal diffusion, causal liquefier module. And we saw some uh, results from, uh, from, from, from the simulation with uh, recoil and hydrodynamics and here, so we saw large broadening and soft particle enhancement with uh, when we included recoil, and oh, and also we, we we saw good description of just subject of double. And in strongly coupled description, we, when we turn on hydrodynamic medium response, so we do not have clear distinction between uh, so-called backland and. Uh, and and jet collected uh, and and mid and 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 jet energy momentum uh, carried by medium. So we need to have back and subtraction. And and but but once we have, we can see jet correlated structure in hydrogen emission also uh, also in from the back the, the bulk medium. So the particle emitted from bulk can they are collated with jet collated with jet. And we have some uh, outlook, so we need to do. We need to work harder to do a simulation, a realistic simulation with hydrodynamic response to see how it how it can modify the jet substructure. And also, uh, we need to have uh, we need to have a, a more detailed systematic studies with inclusion of uh, of hydrodynamic medium response. So that's all from me. So now I can. Uh, I can answer the question if, uh, on Slack if we have. Yes, thank you. There is uh, one more question on Slack, uh, which mm. is, could you please explain again why you need to introduce a causal profile to the source term? And does it have any effect on the final observables, such as the jet profile and fragmentation functions? So uh, yeah, uh, so why we use causal profile is so actually uh, also there is a common way to have uh, to create uh, to generate source source term. and so that one is uh, just use uh, Gaussian, but Gaussian is can be interpolated as the solution of uh, non-relativistic diffusion equation. Uh, with initial condition of uh, delta function, but here we are doing some. Uh, we are doing very relativistic. So just naively we extended its formulation to relativistic case. So we use causal or diffusion equation for it. Uh, but and also, but actually this can the profile. Uh, generated in this stage can affect the final result because if we have a very small profile, uh, if if we have very small profile uh, by tuning some parameters here, uh, so just so uh, just structure uh, inside inside of just structure uh, from so just structure brought by the the medium part can also have uh, uh, have uh, have uh, have a detail uh, small structures, but if if they, they if we need to have a uh, very uh, large source profile, so uh, 
the the contribution from the medium uh, medium can be smeared a lot and so this kind of structure can affect the final result of just substructure we we expect so uh but we need to study uh very carefully about it yeah okay thank you this seems to be all the questions so far that have not really been addressed um ah, sorry so my head my the battery I, I run out of the battery of my headset so i i i couldn't hear uh, what you said so. oh i said there were no more questions that had not been addressed on this slide. Ah, okay okay so uh so for hands-on session uh for me jet uh for this uh this topic uh actually there is no preparation for uh, which should be done today so I'm going to do everything in next week, uh, but please follow Goiko's instruction because I also use that structure. So that's all for me. Thanks. Great. Do they have any big downloads um, that they should do in advance, or nothing beyond what Goiko directed them to? No. no. Okay. Excellent. So. Um, I think make sure you know what the follow the homework for Goiko session um, so that you're ready on Monday. And I think we can wrap up. Um, have a nice weekend and thanks for a productive session. Thank you.